Welcome to the Earth's Surface Experiment, Part 3. This experiment shows that the visual effect we observe when boats at sea appear to sink below the horizon, hull first, is also observed with objects moving over a flat surface. The image shown here represents the four tennis courts used in this experiment. The black mark represents the location of the camera, or viewer, and the red marks stand for the placement of our object as it moves across the surface. We used a scale of 1 inch equal to 20 feet, with a camera height of 1 1 8 inch, putting our scaled viewer height at 22 and a half feet. The distance of our object from the viewer at each placement point will be given in the following videos. Take note of what happens to the bottom of the object. The large object sits at 3 and 3 fourths inches tall, 9 inches wide, or 75 by 180 feet. The toy boat is two and one fourth inches tall and four and a half inches wide, or 45 by 90 feet. This image shows them at a distance of 18 feet from our viewer, or four fifths of a mile away. Here, they are 36 feet, or 1.6 miles away. This location is at 55 feet and two inches, or two and a half miles away. Now, the objects are at 73 feet, two inches, or three and a third miles. Here, we are viewing our objects at a distance of 91 feet, two inches, or 4.1 miles. Notice the mirroring effects beginning at the bottom of the object and boat. This location is at 109 feet, 2 inches, or 5 miles away. The placement of the objects here is at 127 feet, 10 inches, or 5.8 miles. Notice how the yellow bottom of the larger object on the left is no longer visible. Now, our objects are at 145 feet, 10 inches, scaled to 6.6 .6 miles. Here, they're at a distance of 164 feet, 6 inches, or 7.5 miles away. This location of our objects is at 182 feet, 6 inches, or 8.3 miles. Finally, the last placement of our object and toy boat is at a distance of 200 feet, 6 inches, scaled to 9.1 miles. Notice how the entire toy boat is no longer visible.
It is often argued that the disappearance of a boat's hull into the horizon is proof of the boat sailing over a curved Earth. But clearly, on a flat and level surface, the object will also disappear hull first into the horizon. Another argument commonly made is that gaining altitude will allow the viewer to bring an object back into view, thus proving a curved Earth. But as you can see here, the viewer gaining altitude over a flat and level surface will also bring an object back into view. <laughs>